Welcome to today's episode of What's Your Favorite German Word? As always, I'm your host, Laura Phillips, uh, and today all of our contestants are COBRA professors. So I know the suspense is killing you. Let's head down the hall and see what we find. Dr. Perkins, what's your favorite German word? Gesundheit. Thank you, thank you, I'm so sorry. What's your favorite German word? Well, that was my favorite German word. In fact, that's the only German word I know. <laughs> it means health. So you're wish wishing them health in spite of that sneeze. Achoo! Gesundheit. Oh, thank you. Hey there, Dr. Easter. What's your favorite German word? My favorite German word is Zupa. You want to use it in a sentence? The 2021 German study abroad to Leipzig is going to be Zupa. Oh, All right. I think you're right. What's your favorite German word? Mm, my favorite German word is Warvignugen. Was bedeutet das? What does that mean? It means, what does it mean? Oh, uh, it means literally the joy of driving. Mm. Can you use it in a sentence? Sure. After I go drive on the Autobahn, which has no speed limit, highway in Germany, I would feel Warvignugen. Ah, vielen Dank. Tschüss. My favorite German word is Kammerspeck. Kammerspeck? Kammerspeck. It means kind of emotional eating. Technically, it translates as grief bacon. For example, COVID has created the need for Kammerspeck, which I will satisfy tonight with some delicious pasta carbonara. Ooh, that sounds like a great way to uh, experience grief bacon. Grief bacon, I will pay for it soon. <laughs> hey, just a shout out to those of you thinking about going to Germany. Go, it will be transformative. Well, two of my young granddaughters uh, are counting to 10 in German at the moment. And uh, so my favorite word is the one they giggle at, and it happens to be fumpf. So once they hit the number five, it, for some reason, is just a funny word to them. Uh, as in, how many takes did it take to do this video? Funf. Go to Germany, gute Reise. Hey, Dr. Marquardt, what's your favorite German word? My favorite German word is der Frieden. Der Frieden. Der Frieden. Can you tell us what that means? Yes, so, uh, funny story, when I first heard it, I thought everyone was saying freedom. I thought, oh, that must be the same word in German and English. And then I found out they were saying Frieden, which is actually, it means peace in German. If you're talking about making peace, it's Frieden Stifter. So I'm gonna put those two together. And so Jesus said, blessed are the Frieden Stifter, for they will be called the children of God. Have a great day and Auf Wiedersehen. All right, Auf Wiedersehen. Hey, Daniel. Hey. Donner. That's not a German word. Well, it's not a German word. It's a Turkish word for delicious food. And the first time I went to Germany it was all over the place. So that's one of the memories I have from going to Germany is eating Donner. So you would recommend that? I would absolutely recommend some Donner when you, when you are there. It's cheap, it's fast, and you can walk and eat. And again, you I mentioned that it's delicious. All right. Delicious. Excellent. That sounds like a really great recommendation. Yes, it is. All right. Thank you. Danke sehr. Thank you. Six German words and one bonus Turkish word to get you started on your German language lessons. My favorite German word right now would be V. The English equivalent is Wanderlust, which ironically is a German word. And it literally means far sickness, like the opposite of homesickness. So it is the desire to travel or the definition I really like is an ache for faraway places. If you have fair V or think you might, the fall semester in Germany 2021 is a great way to address that. We have a great group signed up and we would love for you to join us. Applications are available or you can email myself or Dr. Sarah Easter. We would love to sit down and talk to you about ways that you can join us.